When you're the shortest D1 player ever, your finishing has to be crafty. And I really love this technique that Darnell Rogers uses pretty consistently to jump into defenders with momentum. Players are starting to realize how important creating contact is when finishing, but notice how he actually drives at a wider angle, which creates some space from the defender on his way to the rim. Then he uses that space to jump into the defender with more momentum. And he does it early too. He's well outside the paint here when he jumps, which throws off that defender's timing. So all of this feels a little bit weird. Driving at a wide angle, jumping laterally to finish, jumping so early. But that's why we train. You guys will start off the dribble. I know where you're going because you have to take this angle downhill. All right, so let's say I'm on defense. Either one of you guys can go. All right, you have to beat me this way. So because I know where you're going, I will probably be, so just go slow-mo, I'll probably be right here with you. Your goal is to take this really tight angle around me, and even when you feel the contact, just keep going through it. Okay. All right. All right. Yes, there we go. Nice. What is off on? All right, now think about it this way. So you guys picked that up very well of just continuing on your line. Now think about Manny, you're playing defense here. Mm -hmm. Instead of doing that, you bounce out to create space for me. And then just like I showed you in the clips, jumping back into me. Right. So again, slow motion here. I'm here and then I bounce out and then jump into you there. So I'm creating space for me to jump back into you. You can do either one though. You can keep going on your line with the contact or you can separate from me, up to you. Nice, solid. Decent. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So I think, I think what happened there is that you can do it this way, but instead of like bouncing back and then jumping forward, it's almost just kind of shifting your angle a bit. So it's more of like a here, see it's just like that quick bounce out rather than like completely just saying fuck your line. Okay, so jump the shoulder a little bit, like a little, turn the shoulder. Yeah, so you're here and then here. It's just like that subtle just, Boom, to create space, and then jumping back. Not bad, maybe even a little bit less than that. Yes, there we go. That's good. You felt decent. Yeah. That's good. Nice. That's good. Oh yeah. Hell no. Yeah. Hell no. One more. Nice man. Hey. Oh yeah, I'll finish it for you. One free throw each. We'll come right back. Uh, defense will start. Offense and defense will start right next to each other. So Manny, let's say you're here. All right. You are going. You can take any angle you want. Yeah. I gotta take. Actually, we'll step over even more this way. So okay. I'll be right here. I gotta bounce out and get around the elbow. Yeah. So now I have a little bit of space from you. Uh -huh. Once you start chasing me here, my goal is to get back into you and create that contact. All right, so we're kind of artificially creating that space here. Boom, and then I'm using that to close space and get into you. All right, defense, you can wall up. You can even do this. Pull that chair, fuck with him a little bit. All right, let's try it. Uh, you can choose whatever angle you want. So as soon as he bounces out, he's got to go around the elbow. Other than that, it's just no rules. Not bad. All right, let's alternate for now, and then we'll compete just to get the feel for it. Think timing, so 
instead of, well not instead of, but what? I'm here, I take one, two, and you're predicting that. Yeah. I'll show you guys in the video, but what you'll see with him is like, literally be here and then from jumping from out here. So you're like, oh shit, I'm not even ready for that. All right, so you can do that where it's the same timing, but also try to play around with it. Maybe you jump earlier from further out, all that stuff. Yeah, there we go. That's good. Yes, sir. Damn. What? Yeah, bro, and he's jumping to the side too, which is the crazy part. Getting hit. Yeah, and, but that time he pulled the chair a little bit, but it was because he was like, oh shit, I'm not ready for it. This one, he's jumping from, like he's loading up to jump from all the way out there. Nice. Oh, let's go, same thing, other side now. So going to the left. Yeah, good shit though, man. Yes. Nice. All right, last one I want to see here, I'll take a little break, is try to get really creative with this. So I've been over here trying to think of some creative ass shit. You can even hit up here. You can get like a little inside hand. You could go like a slower version of it here so you bounce out and then you're like, kind of like a little Luca finish. You could pump fake, just get creative with it for the last one or two. Nice.